Hello friends and welcome to another tutorial on Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we are going to learn about the touch command in Linux. The touch command can be used to create new empty files easily. Touch can create any number of files simultaneously. It is also used to change the timestamps on existing files and directories. First, let us see how can we create files using touch. Touch followed by the file name or file names will create the empty files. In this example, we are creating three files, file1, file2 and file3. Let us see this on our system. Note, currently I am in my desktop directory. Now. Let me type touch space file1, file2 and file3 and hit enter. Now let me just type ls. As you can see the three files file1, file2 and file3 have been created. Next let us learn how can we modify timestamp using touch. Every file in Linux is associated with timestamps which specifies the last access time, last modification time and last change time. Whenever we create a new file or modify an existing file, these time stamps will be updated automatically. Let us first learn about the type of time stamps. So we have access time which shows the last time the file was read modification time which shows the last time the content of the file was modified and change time which shows the last time the file's metadata which basically include size, type, etc. were changed. You can view these timestamp by, by typing the stat command followed by the file name. Let us look at the timestamps of the file we just created on our system. So let me type stat space file1. Now you can see the access time, modified time and the change time of file1. Next let us learn how can we change the timestamps using touch. Touch can be used to change access and modification time individually. The minus m followed by the file name will update the file's modification time to the current date and time and the minus a option will update the file's access time to current date and time. Let us see them in action. So let me type touch space minus a file 1 and hit enter. Now let's type stat space file 1. As you can see, the access time has been changed for file 1. Similarly, we can also change the modification time by using minus m option. Next, let us learn how can we set the time to an arbitrary time? If you need to set modification time to an arbitrary time, we use the minus D option followed by the timestamp in string. This will modify the timestamp to 15th June 2019, 8.40 pm. Let us see this on our system. So let me type touch space minus t followed by 2019 06 15 and 20 now let's see the stat as you can see the modified time has been changed to 15 june 2019 that's all for the touch command for any doubts or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.